Once again, hello, friends, young and old at Grace Fellowship Church. I hope you have your markers ready. And I'll remind you, you can always pause this drawing or restart this video uh, while we're doing this so you can keep up with your drawing. But today we're going to draw an animal. We'll start with the nose. A cold, wet, drippy nose. Maybe you can figure out what animal I'm talking about. Here's the mouth. This is going to give it away a large, panting, dripping tongue. That's right, we are drawing a dog. We'll make some cartoon eyes. Cartoon eyes, we'll make the head around it. If it's a dog, it has big, floppy ears. And we'll draw the front paws. He's standing straight on, looking at you. Males. His hind legs, again, standing, looking straight at you. And of course, besides a dog's nose and tongue, we know a dog is known for its tail. And since the dog is looking at you waiting to be petted, he's wagging the tail. If he's an outside dog, maybe he has fleas and gnats. If he's an inside dog, he's got hair from one end of the house to the other probably that you have to vacuum up. So what's the point? The point is this. There is a saying about a dog that he is man's best friend. Well, the Bible talks a lot about friends. In Proverbs 18, 24, it tells us that a man who has friends must himself be friendly. And there is a friend who sticks closer than a brother. In other words, to have friends, you have to be a friend. But when Jesus talked about friendship in John 15, verse 13, he said that greater love has no one has no one than this, than to lay down one's life for his friends. In other words, the greatest demonstration of friendship is sacrifice. So here's the question. How do you know you are a friend of Jesus? Jesus said, you are my friend. If you do whatever I command you. So I hope during this time, being stuck in the house, being away from school and away from some of your other friends, you understand that your best friend is Jesus. How do you know you're his friend? I hope you're being obedient to the commands of Jesus. Until next time, see you later.